New evidence emerges showing Hillary Clinton's private email server was hacked and monitored by the Chinese. One America's John Hines has more. Newly released information from a Senate investigation reveals that Hillary Clinton's private email server was penetrated by Chinese spyware while she was serving as Secretary of State. And in fact, the breach was reported, yet nothing was done by the FBI. The um, staff of the intelligence community's in inspector general went to the FBI and brought to them very disturbing information about a potentially devastating hack by the Chinese government of Hillary Clinton's email server during her entire four years. The FBI dismissed it and was not interested. That from veteran investigative journalist Richard Pollack, who says in this case, IG investigator Frank Rucker reported about Hillary Clinton's breach server to none other than former FBI agent Peter Strzok. And it was Strzok who declined to pursue evidence of Chinese monitoring of Clinton's offsite server. Frank Rucker, who was the chief investigator, and he didn't realize that the man that he was talking to, Peter Strzok, which we now know, was a person who was very much a pro-Hillary partisan advocate in the FBI. That he, the last thing he wanted to hear was that Hillary Clinton's emails were, in fact, uh, breached by the Chinese. And so he dismissed it. The language in the report says that he was cold and indifferent, uninterested in the information that Mr. Ruckert had presented. And according to Pollack, the inaction violated FBI policy, procedures, and protocols. Although the joint report of the Senate Judiciary and Homeland Security's committees, led by Republican senators, says the investigation failed to confirm whether an intrusion into Clinton's server actually occurred, the report was released at 7 p.m., well after business hours in mid-August, when Congress and much of official Washington is gone. A classic way to bury something and ensure it doesn't become a news story, says Pollock. What this says to me is they wanted to bury this story. I don't know why they would, why they would decide to basically bury their own report. It is at this point incomprehensible to me as to why they would want to do that. Pollock, who joins One America News in September as an investigative reporter, added that the Senate report lacks many details, which likely means the committee staff knows more than they're telling us. John Hines, One America News, Washington. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.